10 seconds into this game, Secura was looking there for Shearhorn and just barely missed. Now Secura back, shot and score! Brad Shearhorn gets an early goal, 19 seconds into this first period and puts Dartmouth up on the board, 1-0. Well, we said they had to come out and score quickly, and uh, pretty tough to get quicker than that in a, in a game like this. Uh, only 19 seconds in. How about that? Get anything going. Look at Dartmouth coming four wide the other way. Four on three, drop pass to Kreba. Shot in, loose puck in front of the net. Score! Dartmouth in a scrum makes us a 2-0 lead. 11.49 left to go in this first period. Dartmouth is out playing them in every, every uh, aspect of the game right now. Cornell's just chipping in and washing the puck out there and uh, Darwin's got a little bit of spunk here in this game going back. Huge momentum but again very very tough here with two men down as it's going to be cycled around and there you go that is it. Bardro makes it a two to one game only uh, just uh, eight seconds into that uh, power play here for the Big Reds so uh, with that uh, Cornell cuts the lead in half. It's 2-1 with 10-10 left in the first. A lot of scoring here early on in this game. Uh, three goals and we're uh, not even halfway through the first period yet. So uh, Dartmouth just got to settle down and uh, they had such a great getting uh, pretty physical there. They have some big guys. Uh, number nine, I think that's uh, Hillbrick is 6'7", 220. So uh, those big bodies there are uh, creating a little bit of trouble for Dartmouth. Here's Ryan with a shot and a score. It is now a 2-2 game as Joaquin Ryan put it uh, right over the stick of James Kruger for his first goal of the season for the senior out of Rumson, New Jersey. And just like that, Dartmouth's two-goal lead. Yeah, Nobody's yeah, not even getting shots yeah, on goal. Yeah, yeah. So. And, it's, and it's just, uh, it's just, you know, like one at score! <laughs> there it is! You know, I think you need to talk about it about how things are starting to slow down to make things pick up. And you mentioned Eric Neely off the score sheet tonight. Until now, he gets the go-ahead goal. 7.59 left to go in this third period. Yeah, he's been on a tear lately. Uh, averaging a point a game, 23 points in 23 games. Make that 24 points in 24 games. So. Uh, Darman needed some energy in this building. It was getting pretty stagnant yeah. in here. Uh. <laughs> but he's going to take some time off the clock as he tacks it to the far boards back behind the net. Here comes Ryan again. 20 seconds left to go in the game. Ryan plays it forward. Hillbrick. Now Bardro shot in on net. Loose puck. Goes back down into the corner. Shearhorn tries to clear. Kept in by the Big Red. Ryan, eight seconds left to go in the game. McCarran shot over the glass. Now four, three, two, one. That is going to do it. Dartmouth beats Cornell here at Thompson Arena. Three to two. And Dartmouth swarming the ice. Thompson Arena loving this one. Dartmouth goes to a seven-game unbeaten streak.